Hello, and I got some sad news coming out of Florida this morning. This happened, it was published about an hour ago, so. But it happened this morning, early this morning. Uh, but before I get to it, could you guys help me out by hitting the like button and subscribing? Sharing this video, get the word out. Now on to the story. FBI identified slain agent to exemplified heroism in Fort Lauderdale shooting. Yeah, that really sucks. I need more cops, not less. The FBI, the FBI released identify identities of two federal agents who were killed in a shooting early Tuesday morning. As law enforcement officials attempted to serve a search warrant in a child pornography case, to a suspect who barricaded himself inside his home in a Fort Lauderdale subdue, suburb. Tragically, the FBI lost two of our own today, FBI Director Christopher Ray said in a statement. Special Agents Danielle Alfin and Special Agent Lauren Schwartzenberger were shot and killed this morning in the line of duty while executing a federal court order search warrant in crimes against children investigating in Sunrise, Florida. Both agents had a history of investigating uh, those type of crimes, according to the Miami Herald. Alfin 36, who had been an FBI special agent since 2009, was recently involved in a case against an aide to the mayor of Miami who was accused of luring teenage, a teenage victim to City Hall under the guise of an interview and then kissing following him during a meeting. When Renee Pandoras, who was recently facing state charges that would later drop for federal charges filed in March 2020, allegedly sent lewd photos to the victim as well. Alvin was also involved in a FBI hacking campaign to expose uh, child pics circulating on the dark, dark website Playpen. The investigator later brought down the founder of the site, Stephen Chase, who was sentenced to 30 years in prison in 2017. Schwarzenberger, 43 and 8, agent since 05, also worked in child crimes. In investigation, many involved in uh, pics on the internet. I have to kind of like um, censor the words because of YouTube. She was active in the community as well, visiting middle schools to teach students about the danger of online people. Yeah. This really sucks. Uh, my thoughts to the families. Uh, I hope that guy gets killed. Oh no, I hope the guy survives. Be sent to prison. Put in gin pop and let the criminal scum handle him. So what do you guys think? So he gets be thrown in gin pop and let the other people handle the guy? Please let me know down below. And if you made it this far, you hit that like button and subscribing. As always, be good, have fun, stay safe, bye bye.